Okay, our lesson for today is all about difference of two squares. And our objective is to find the factor of difference of two squares. Okay, so this lesson is for grade 8 math for the first quarter. And it is in module 1, special products and factors. And it is based on milk, most essential learning competencies, which is factors, completely different types of polynomials. Okay, for the week 1 to 2 and K to 12 with the CG code M8AL-1A-B-1. Okay, so first, uh, what is perfect square? Okay, so we're going to recall perfect square. Perfect square, it is the square of an integer, okay, or a square of a number, or the product of a rational number multiplied by itself. Okay, let's have an example. Okay, so let's try the following um, numbers or square of a numbers. Okay, so let's have 1 is square. It is equivalent to 1 times 1 and it is equal to 1. Okay, so a square of 2 or 2 is square. It is equivalent to 2 times 2 equals 4. Then we have 3 is square equivalent to 3 times 3 equals 9. Okay, next, 4 is square is equivalent to 4 times 4 equals 16. Square of 5 is equal to 5 times 5, then it is equal to 25. And for the variable, x square is equivalent to x times x equals x square. Okay, so as you can see, we square numbers. So, next, for the variables, okay, so let's have another example of variables here. Um... We have x cubed square equals, or it is equivalent to x cubed times x cubed, and it is equal to x raised to 6, okay? So, we're going to add their exponent, okay? So, next is y raised to 4 raised to another power 2, then it is equal to y raised to 4 times y raised to 4 and it is equal to y raised to 8 okay so we're going to add their exponent 1 4 9 25 16 so these are what we call perfect square or an example of perfect squares okay so let's have an example or another example of perfect squares can you give some perfect square or some example so let's have this one. 81 is the square of 9. 64 is the square of 8. 100 is the square of 10. 121 is the square of 11. 36 is square of 6. 49 is square of 7. A raised to 6 is square of A raised to 3. Y raised to 8 is the square of Y raised to 4 and X raised to 4. Y square is the square of X square Y. Okay, so note to factor the difference of two squares. First term must be perfect square. Okay, dapat perfect square ang first term. Next, last term or the second term must be perfect square. Minus is the middle sign of the polynomial. Okay, so before we proceed, um, so let's have this activity. We're going to find out whether the given polynomial is the difference of these squares or not. Okay, so let's have this example. Uh, x square minus 4. Yes, this is difference of 2 square. Why? Because the first term x square is a perfect square. Uh, last term is also a perfect square and the middle sign is negative. Okay, so next. The 4x square plus 25. This is not difference of 2 squares. Why? Because um, the middle sign is positive. Okay. Next, um, x raised to 4 minus 9y square is difference of two squares because the first term is perfect square and the second term or the last term is also a perfect square and the middle sign is negative. Then last, we have 2x square minus 12. Okay, so the middle sign is, is negative but the first term is not perfect square. 
and the last term or the second term is not perfect square. Therefore, this is not the difference of two squares. Okay, now I think you're ready. And now let's proceed to the factoring of difference of two squares. The factor form of a polynomial that is difference of two squares is the sum and difference of the square roots of the first and last terms. Okay, example one. Factor x squared minus 25. The first step is to find the square root of the first and the second term. Okay, so the first term is x squared. So the square root of x squared is um, x. Well, the second term is 25. The square root of 25 is 5. Okay, step number 2. To write their factors, write the product of the sum and difference of the square roots. Sum means plus, difference means minus or positive. Um, sum is positive and difference is negative. Okay, so we have x plus 5 times x minus 5. Okay, so that is the factor of x squared minus 25. Okay, again, to factor x squared minus 25, the answer is x plus 5 times the quantity of x minus 5. Okay, so that is how to factor the difference of two squares. Okay, but before that, let's review on how to find the square root of the following numbers. Okay, square root of 25 is equivalent to 5 is square. Square root is equivalent to 1 half. So therefore, we have 5 squared times 1 half. And then, we multiply the exponent. So, we have 5. 2 times 1 is 2 over 2. So, 2 over 2 is equal to 1. So, therefore, we have 5 raised to 1 is equal to 5. Okay. So, that is how to find. Next, square root of 49 is equivalent to 7 square or square root of 7 square. And then, since square root is equivalent to 1 half, you multiply it by 1 half. So, 7 times or 7 square times 1 half is 7 raised to 2 over 2. Then, it's equal to 2 divided by 2 is 1. So, we have 7 raised to 1 and it is equal to 7. Okay, next number 3, square root of 81, equivalent to square root of 9 square. So, the equivalent of square, yeah, square root is 1 half. So, we have 9 times, or 9 square raised to 2 times 1 half. Then, 9 raised to 2 over 2, then is equal to 9 raised to 1 equals 9. So, that is how to find the square root of the numbers, okay? Okay, now let's have another way in how to find the square root. So, we have a square root of 25, square balance 2, square root of 5 is square, the index is 2. So, we can cancel the index and the square. So, therefore, we have 5. Square root of 36, okay, cancel 2, which is the square root, the index of the square root is 2. So, we have now 6. And square root of x square, so index is 2. So, we can cancel 2 equals x. Okay, so next number 4, 9x raised to 4, square root of 9x raised to 4, x raised to 4 is equivalent to x square times 2, we squared x square, so that is x raised to 4, so we can cancel the index and the squares. Okay, the answer is 9x square, okay, so now I think you're ready for the next uh, example. Factor 4x squared minus 36y squared. First step, find the square root of the first and the second term. Square root of 4x squared is, the answer is 2x. And we have 36y squared. The square root of 36y squared is 6y. Okay. Okay, for the second step, to write their factors, write the product of the sum and difference of the square roots. Okay, so therefore, the answer is the quantity of 2x plus 6y times the quantity of 2x minus 6y. Okay, so again, the factor of 4x square minus 36y square is equal to... The quantity of 2x plus 6y times the quantity of 2x minus 6y, okay? So, this is for your activity. You're going to factor the following difference of 2 squares, okay? Number 1, 4x squared minus 16. Number 2, 5x raised to 6 minus 4y squared. Number 3, 9x squared y raised to 4 minus 100. And number 4, 81x squared minus 64y raised to 8, okay? 
So, good luck. So, thank you for watching. So, please subscribe, like, and click the bell for more math videos.